Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. We are on our way to Austin today. It's me, Elena, and my parents actually, because Omar wasn't able to make it. He's picking up his mom from the airport today. Who's my dad? <laughs> we just stopped to go to the bathroom. What's mama doing this? Who's that? Safe seed though. She's eating a cucumber right now. <laughs> She's honestly been doing so good. My dad's been sitting back here with her. It's a four-hour drive from our town to Austin. We are going for an Amazon event that I was invited to, so I'm gonna take you guys along. Just arrived to the hotel. We are staying at the Austin Proper, which is actually my absolute favorite hotel in Austin. It is so luxurious, so I'll give you guys a little rundown on the room. I have this little seating area and my bed that me and Elena are gonna share. Went ahead and ordered Uber Eats, so my parents are coming in just a sec. We're gonna all eat this. Got pizza for Elena, just in case she didn't want any of the bowl. The best part about the Austin proper is that they use Aesop in the shower. I feel like I've showed you guys this before because we've visited the Austin proper before, but they have the best showers because of those products. They smell so Look, I just had my parents and Elena up here. It was pretty hectic, so I didn't film any of it, but we just ate. I fed Elena her pizza. She did not want have to have anything to do with my like chicken and rice bowl, so I'm glad I got the pizza so she at least ate something. I am actually getting ready for dinner tonight. I'm gonna be wearing this linen green dress with some white jeans. I wanted to add a little bit more color because I'm always wearing white neutrals. Even started adding some black here and there now, but I'm trying to just be a little bit more vibrant for summer, a little bit at least. And I got my little handy steamer that's like a travel size that folds up, it's so convenient. I'm gonna get to steaming this and I'll show you guys my full look and we will head to dinner. Dressed and ready for dinner tonight, I have on this pretty lavish linen green top that I just steamed. It is so, so pretty. I also have it in black. Then I have on these old navy skinny jeans that are like a cream color. They're perfect to go with any like longer tunics that you guys have this summer. They're kind of like cut off a little bit. And then I have on these mules. So that is my look and I have an Amazon bag. Let's go ahead and head to dinner. I also want to give a shout out to my fashion tape. You guys know I've been doing my looser hijab style with this, but I've been getting so much use out of this stuff just like outside of my hijab, like on my actual clothes, where I guess it's meant usually, but I just taped it down here and up here and under here so that it doesn't like move. And so it's a little bit more closed and I just feel so much more secure that way. Just touched up my makeup. I probably needed to just take off all my makeup and reapply at this point, but I didn't really have the time to do that. So I just touched up my lips and did a little bit more highlight and hopefully this is good enough for dinner tonight. Hopefully it'll be like dim in the room and nobody will really notice that I've had this makeup on all day long. Um, I did wanna show you guys my new ring. So it's funny because this is actually a travel ring that I got on Amazon for like, I think it was like $40. I wanted one that looked exactly like my other ring. So I'll show you guys, I'll show you guys a little bit more up close. I'll try to insert some more footage of it so you guys can see. But if you were ever wondering like what my ring looked like in person, just, if you order this ring, you will know because it looks literally pretty much identical. It even has the hidden halo on the side of the ring. I just wanted to get a travel ring since I travel pretty often. I don't really feel comfortable bringing my actual ring with me because I have left a ring in a hotel room once. I'm glad that I have a like one that I don't really care if I lose or whatever, but I can still look married because I usually just travel with nothing and then I feel like naked without a ring on my finger. because Elena is sleeping back there. This girl went to sleep at 12.30 last night, you guys. I didn't get much footage from the dinner last night, but it was so beautiful. I met so many amazing girls. I met the Amazon team, and it was just so, so nice. It was like a courtyard at this house that they rented, and it was like garden theme with all these beautiful flowers everywhere, and they had a pool in the middle and candles, and then at night, once the sun went down, all the candles looked so pretty. Anyway, got back from this event thinking that my parents might have gotten Elena to sleep because it was way past her bedtime. Came into this room and this girl was over here just bouncing off the walls, so hyper. 
and I was like, oh my gosh, so my parents left to go to sleep and I still need to like get my makeup off and I was so sweaty because it was an outdoor event and it's so hot here in Texas. So I really need to take a shower. She was just not sleeping because we're not at home. She's not like in her element. I was just gonna take a shower and put her in the bathroom with like my phone so she could watch something. And of course she wanted to get in the shower. So I let her get in the shower with me and then she was slipping and sliding everywhere. And so I had to hold her while I was taking the shower and I had to do everything with one hand and it was basically just a disaster. She did not sleep till 12.30 last night and it was <laughs> it was just like a cartoon trying to get ready for bed. I got up super early this morning, got my makeup and everything done and I have one more thing. I need to go to this little event this morning with Amazon and then the rest of the day, I'm just gonna go eat with my family and then we're gonna head home. I'm just waiting on my mom because she's gonna come watch Elena while I go run downstairs and go to this event. Good morning, Elena. You woke up. <laughs> Did Cedar build you a fort? Oh, yeah. Did you build you a fort? Hi, Mama. Shh. <laughs> My beautiful girl. I love it. You're so beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> so beautiful, Mama. Inshallah. <laughs> oh, we're the best baby ever. We are actually thinking about weaning her off the pacifier soon. Right now she only uses it for naps and bedtime, but it's so helpful. <laughs> so I don't know what to do. If you guys have any tips for weaning off a pass, let me know. <gasps> Pazzy. <laughs> but they're so cute with the Pazzy too, because they look more like a baby. We're back from Austin. I was actually planning on this whole vlog being of Austin, but I did not get enough footage because every other moment that I wasn't vlogging, I was either chasing Elena or I was at one of the Amazon events and it was just really hard for me to vlog while I was at the events because I was talking too much to too many people and it was just so nice meeting everyone from the Amazon team and a bunch of other sweet influencers. They also gave us the inside scoop on Prime Day. So they gave us the dates. It's July, I think 12th and 13th. They gave us a little sneak peek on some of the items that are gonna be on sale and there's actually a lot of good pieces that I'm actually really excited about. So I'll be sharing that more um, once the sale goes live. But anyways, today is actually Father's Day. So I'm in the kitchen. I'm about to make Omar a really yummy lunch. This was actually supposed to be dinner, but we don't have any food right now. And <laughs> Elena's napping, so I'm just gonna make it now. I have some lamb chops that I'm gonna season and throw in the air fryer. I've actually never made lamb chops at home, but I heard that if you do it in the air fryer, it turns out really good. I have some asparagus because he loves asparagus and potatoes. I'm also gonna make a salad. I have some mixed greens in the fridge. I'm gonna go ahead and get to cooking. Okay, I'm gonna add some olive oil. Are we going to do the stairs first? Too long, you're not gonna eat lamb chops. Well, she might. Remember she how might. she ate them at that restaurant yeah. in Mexico? <laughs> well, when she sees, like, she saw my dad eating them. Yeah. She wanted it, so we'll see. <laughs> but I'm making her favorite, which is pesto pasta. Yeah. She loves. She takes it. after her mama. <laughs> Everything is done, you guys. The lamb chops look so good. I cannot wait to tell you guys how they turned out. I made some pesto pasta for my Lele. She is so hungry, ready to eat. She keeps grabbing the ball. 
So I'm gonna do a little taste test with Omar. We'll see how he likes the lamb chops. What's this? Sparkling water. Sparkling water. <laughs> you guys, her obsession with sparkling water has not gone away. She's obsessed. Got worse. She's my daughter. What can I say? Here we go. Oh. It's good. Wow. Really? I've never made them before. How's the like can, like the texture and everything with the air fryer? Did it make it like good? Those are so good. Like putting them in the air fryer is a game changer. Oh, okay. I can't sure. wait to try it. We lived the party outside. Elena was getting bored. It is actually so hot outside, but we put these in the shade so it's not too bad. We have the splash pad that's filling up right now, and then her little water table. We have been getting so much use out of these this summer. She's been loving them. I can link it for y'all if you have a toddler. These are like a backyard must have. I also saw a blogger, her name's Nita on Instagram. She put this in her shower. So that's another like genius idea for if it's like too hot. Dinner was actually so yummy. I will leave the link down below to the recipe I used for the lamb chops because they were so delicious. I used my air fryer and they turned out so perfect. I'm gonna do my skincare, get my makeup off and everything, and just catch up a little bit with you guys. I'm gonna use my favorite makeup remover balm by Pharmacy. This one's just clean and just gets everything off. Oh my gosh, today I'm so exhausted because I've spent the day just <laughs> entertaining Elena and she's just at the age right now where she just has to be going non-stop like all day long or she will be like fussy and upset and mad so in trying to keep her entertained i've just worn myself out we went to little land which is like this play place we went and did the splash thing outside took a bath went upstairs played blocks and she loves to listen to the piano omar plays um piano and he like recorded himself playing and so we have to play it every time we go up there after i take my makeup off i use the kale and green tea spinach and vitamins superfood cleanser by youth to the people this one i have repurchased two times so far i love it it's gentle but it works so well i just finished up my skincare i thought i would just quickly run through the products that i use i've shared this with you guys before this is the paula's choice two percent bha exfoliating liquid Oh my gosh, so my skin's been feeling pretty congested a little bit, especially after the travel. This stuff just does such a good job at smoothing out the skin, at getting rid of all the dead skin cells. I've been going really hard with this stuff for the past like probably three days. I've used it morning and night. And I also, this is probably not the best advice to give everyone, but if you don't have sensitive skin, then this might work for you. So I just do a tiny drop of the good jeans on top of that just for like a little bit more exfoliation and my skin has been looking so good i mean like look how smooth it is this stuff is amazing so if you guys like the good jeans i mean obviously this stuff is so expensive i would definitely try this because i think it's only like 30 dollars or something and it is so good at just like exfoliating and just smoothing everything and then i went over that with my Belief Aqua Balm Moisturizer, my favorite. And that is everything that I used on my skin. I guess I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here. I'm sorry this kind of was like all over the place, but next week I am gonna be sharing a little bit more like new and stuff, some like summer fashion and stuff like that. So if you guys have any video requests or if you just like, like vlogs, just leave me your feedback down below and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.